News 12 local headlines from EPB. This is the place for the latest news from around the Tennessee Valley and North Georgia. Hello everybody, it's me Andrew Harrison. Here's a look what's making headlines for you right now. Chattanooga's came together today to remember those we lost 23 years ago today on September 11, 2001. According to the 9-11 Memorial and Museum in New York, 2,977 souls were lost when four planes were hijacked by terrorists from the Middle Eastern group Al-Qaeda. Those planes crashed into the World Trade Center in New York and the Pentagon in Washington, also an open field in Shanksville, Pennsylvania. Scenic City Women's Network hosted a remembrance ceremony at the Hamilton County Courts building today. The featured speaker was retired General B.B. Bell. He pulled no punches in reflecting on experiencing the attack firsthand in Washington when he saw American Airlines Flight 77 hit the Pentagon. And I'm looking that way across the Potomac, about four miles away at the Pentagon. That's where I wanted to go when the Pentagon exploded in front of my very eyes. Now it's four miles away and it was just surreal. And I've been in war before. This was a war zone. At least 184 civilians lost their lives at the Pentagon that day, according to the U.S. Department of Defense. We will never forget. The intersection at Pine Hill Road and Lee Highway in Collegedale completely closed until further notice. Collegedale police say that road's closed because of progressive erosion. Yeah, you don't want that. Roadway's also unsafe to drive on. You get to kind of look at the erosion out there. It's kind of fallen away. The police encourage folks to take an alternate route and don't remove the signs and drive around. Moving to those barriers is a criminal uh, criminal offense uh, that is subject up to fines and jail time. So we would urge the public not to touch any of the barriers. Like we said, this is for the safety of the community. So we would advise everyone to stay away from the area and find an alternate route home. Should be easy enough. The closure on Pine Hill Road and Lee Highway expected to stay in effect until that road is fixed. How long that'll be? No official word yet. I do thank you for joining us for News 12 Headlines, and we'll be back in a mere 60 seconds.